We are now on our third photo P video, and this one is going to be fun. I'm going to teach you how easily you can do a face swap by using photo P. Since the national election is coming soon in the Philippines, I'll be using two of the presidential candidates as the subject. Let's begin. Alright. Let's begin by opening photop.com from any browser. I am using Chrome here. Let me show you the pictures that I'll be using here. This is Lenny Robredo and Bong Bong Marcos, the two front runner for the presidential race here in the Philippines. Let's open the pictures in Photop by dragging and dropping them into the Photop web application. Let's drag and drop both of them. There we go. Now let's put BBM's face first to Lenny's body. Let's select BBM's picture, then copy. Let's paste it as a new layer to Lenny's picture. Then let's reduce the opacity of the BBM layer to about 60%. We need to do this since we are aligning BBM's face with Lenny's face. Now let's enable free transform to BBM's picture. Aside from using the menu, you can also press alt Control t to enable free transform. Now we can resize and reposition BBM's picture by clicking and dragging the points of the picture. When resizing, hold the shift key in your keyboard so that the aspect ratio remains intact and the picture will not be stretched. To rotate at the picture, just place your mouse pointer slightly outside of the free transform points of the picture. The pointer will change to a half circle arrow, then you can hold drag the mouse to rotate the picture. In case you want to learn all about the hotkeys and functions of Photop in order to use it effectively, you can check out the link that will pop in the screen now. You can also get the same link from the video description below. The trick here to have a believable face swap is to align their eyeballs and mouth. We need the picture transparent to do that. When we are all aligned, we will use the lasso tool to cut the face of the BBM layer. Make sure that you are including the eyebrows, eyes, nose and mouth, and the cut should be inside the face of both BBM and Lenny. Okay. Now let's bring back the opacity to 100%. Then let's inverse the selection so that we are selecting everything outside the face. And we are going to delete all of that, leaving just the face that we cut. There we go. Now let's deselect the face. Let me just clean up some edges here. Let's also remove some hair of BBM here as we only need the skin tone here. Any black hair can ruin the blending of skin color later. We also got some hair in the right side, let me remove that as well. There we go. Now let's right click on the BBM layer, then select pixels. Now from the layer stack, select the Lenny layer. The effect of this is we have a selection of BBM's face applied to the Lenny layer. Then go to select menu, then modify, and then contract. Let's enter 6 pixels here, the click OK. This makes the selection reduced by 6 pixels all around. Then we will delete the selection to the Lenny layer. As you can see here now, the selection has been deleted, but remember that we reduced that by 6 pixels, which means there is our 6 pixels overlapping between the BBM and Lenny layer. Which is important for the auto blend function, so that it can determine the correct skin tone when combining the two layers later. Let's now deselect everything. Now we need to select both of the layer. Hold the shift key or control key of your keyboard to select both of the two layers. Then go to edit menu, and click on the auto blend. This will take some time, depending on your computer's processing power and your internet connection. On my ZenBook 13 OLED, it takes between 10 to 30 seconds before the blending is done. It may look like it has freeze, but don't worry, just wait. When the browser asks you to exit the page or wait, just choose wait. There we go. We now have BBM's face on Lenny's body. A nightmare for the BBM and Lenny fanatics. There is an eyebrow flaw here, but that's okay. That's why the cutting part of the face should really include only the skin and not any facial hair. Other than that, it looks good. I mean the blending. The end result is horrific and funny as hell. Now, for the sake of fairness, let's put Lenny's face in BBM's body. Let's open Lenny's picture again by dropping it to the Photop web app. Let's do the same process. Select the picture. Copy it. Then paste it as a new layer over BBM's picture. Now let's do a free transform to resize. Remember to hold the shift key when resizing to keep the aspect ratio. Let's reduce the opacity, make it transparent, so we can align the eyeballs and mouth of the two faces. In case you are not yet that familiar with Photop, I have an introduction video for Photop. It contains everything that you need to know about Photop as a beginner. I'll pop a link in the screen, which you can also get from the video description below. Alright. Looks like we are all aligned now. Let's begin cutting the face. Remember to avoid including any hair, and the cut should both be inside the two faces you are swapping. That looks good. Let's return the opacity to 100% now. This time, let's copy the selected face. Paste it as a new layer. Then let's remove the layer of the whole Lenny's picture. Some of Lenny's layer is covering BBM's hair, let's remove that. That looks good now. 
Let's right click on Lenny layer, then select pixels. Then select the BBM layer from the layer stack. Let's go to select, modify, then contract. Set to 6 pixels, then OK. Make sure we have BBM layer active, let's delete the selection. OK, face is deleted. Let's press Ctrl D to deselect. Now, let's select both layers from the layer stack. Go to edit menu. Then auto blend. Wow. That was fast. There we go. Another nightmare picture for the Lenny and BBM fanatics. This one blended really well. Lenny is handsome as a boy. Marcos as a girl. Well. You decide which is better, or should I ask, which is more horrific, Lenny on BBM's body, or BBM on Lenny's body. Alright. That's it for this one. Just showing you a fun way of doing a face swap. I'm sure most of you will have more creative and horrific ideas where you can use this knowledge. If you enjoy this video, give me a thumbs up. If it has helped you in any way, please do consider subscribing to the channel. Nilasuj for watching. Nobody air.